This is an audiovisual representation of a study published in the Journal of Bone and Joint Surgery in 2021. Among elderly patients with limited mobility, hemiarthroplasty is considered the standard treatment for displaced femoral neck fractures. Even so, there is high variability across countries in the choice of unipolar or bipolar prostheses for the procedure. The bipolar design was developed to reduce the incidence of acetabular erosion, a common postoperative complication. Experts advocate the use of bipolar prostheses in elderly patients because unipolar designs have shown increased acetabular erosion in most studies. However, Given their conflicting results, it is unclear how the choice of design affects revision rates following the procedure. Orthopedic doctors from Australia conducted an analysis based on available Australian Orthopedic Association National Joint Replacement Registry data from 1999 to 2018. They compared the risk of revision arthroplasty for modular unipolar and bipolar prostheses following primary hemiarthroplasty for femoral neck fractures. They studied 62,875 primary hemiarthroplasties. The primary outcome was time to revision for any cause, and hazard ratios were calculated to measure the risk of revision. The researchers found no differences in revision rates between unipolar and bipolar designs for the initial 2.5 years with a hazard ratio of 0.98. However, the hazard ratio increased to 1.86 after 2.5 years, indicating a higher cumulative risk of revision following unipolar prosthesis surgery. There were no differences between unipolar and bipolar designs in terms of the risk of revision for infection, dislocation, or stem type. In summary, due to a higher incidence of acetabular erosion, an increased risk of revision was observed in association with the use of unipolar prostheses as compared with bipolar prostheses 2.5 years after the procedure. Given that bipolar prostheses are more expensive than unipolar designs, this study shows that their use may be justified only for patients with longer life expectancies.